First thing we need is a nice flat surface that I can drill into. So I'm using just a regular end mill here to give me that surface. I like to use WD-40 on aluminum. Leaves me a nice surface finish. I use the wibbler to uh, get the hole lined up straight, right where I want it. Switch over to a pre-drill. And we're just going to drill a small throw hole all the way through. And then we're going to drill the correct size hole for tapping. It's a handheld chamfer to get rid of that burr around the edge. Makes it easier to start to tap too. And here we are tapping for the threads. I want to say it's an eighth inch NPT thread. Apparently I didn't thread deep enough so let's go a little deeper give it a test run here good fit so let's clean all the junk off want to make sure the manifolds are clean don't want to get any of that down in the engine put some Teflon tape around the threads make sure it doesn't leak don't want to get any air leaks in there and then just Screw them in. Here they are left and right together. You're going to need both. One for each side of the motor, obviously. That's it. Quick and easy job. Anyone can do it.